Ladies and gentlemen, before you move forward with your photo booth business idea, I want you guys to pay close attention. And even if you already acquired your photo booth equipment, this is the type of video you guys really need to see because I really want to set the expectation for new folks. If you're struggling to get leads, if your business is not booming, then these are some of the factors you guys have to look into as photo booth business owners. A lot of people won't share this information with you because they don't want to see you grow. But quite honestly, I don't have any competition. I have personal goals. So let me share this with you guys. And I really hope this video switches your business around. And I hope you start applying some of these things, some of these tools. Let's keep this video as short as possible. I'm going to go ahead and minimize my face here. This is what I uh, found out over the last few months. If I go on Google search engine and I type in, for example, 360 photo booth Redlands. This is like a city close close to me and I hit enter. We can see that there's uh, one person that's sponsoring, so they're paying uh, for this position. But if we go down, we see me at the very top, then we see another individual and so on and so forth, okay? So I made it to the very top. What happens when I remove uh, the word 360? And now I just go and I'm searching now for photo booth Redlands. I'm gonna hit enter. All right, so all of a sudden I vanished. I'm not right here on the top anymore. So we still have Superfly who is paying uh, for this position right up here. Um, and then they actually organically made it to the top right here, which is good. But then we have one, two, three, four, and I fall in the fifth place. So I fell fifth place in the Google search engine when I switched the keywords just by one word. Yes, it's that crazy and it's that detrimental for you to know this information. Now, for example, guys, if I go over to Local Dominator and I go over to Scans, and this is just me being very transparent with you guys, I do want everyone to do well in business, but you guys have to really put in the work and apply that energy in places where it's going to matter the most. Now, as you guys can see, I ran two scans today. One was for the short-term uh, keyword in Photo Booth and another one for uh, where is it at? Right here. Where is it at? Right here. Photo booth and then photo booth rental. I know we're only removing one word, but look at the difference, guys. For my Google profile, when I just looked for photo booth, my average rank was 13.24. That's not a good score. The lower this number is, the higher you are ranking. But when I went to go add rental to this keyword, then my average rank improved drastically. Now we're at a 4.46, which means I am doing a lot better in that space. Now, how does that look on a map and how does that algorithm print a photo for you guys? Well, let me show you where you guys are seeing the green area. That's where David, my business is doing really well. Where you guys see the yellow and the red, that means that there's actually a business around that area that's definitely killing it and they're definitely taking over that entire area. So for example, if I zoom in a little bit and I go to this area down here where I fall under seventh place and I click on the seven, it's gonna show me that this business right here called Picture Your Party is dominating with 26 Google reviews. So when I click on their profile and I go back to the map, then it shows me their results. They're only killing it in this little area right here. All right, so that's what's happening right now. Now, everywhere else where you guys see the sevens, the eights, the fives, that means that they're not ranking further out. So the name of the game here, ladies and gentlemen, is to rank as far out as possible so that you guys can get a ton of leads, get funnel those in, and then convert those inquiries into actual bookings so that you guys really start making a good amount of money in this industry. Guys, pay attention to this part of your business. Please do not fall back and do not let your business die out. Focus on SEO. Start acquiring more online real estate presence for certain keywords, please. I hope this video helps. Do your thing. But remember, apply that energy and time into something that truly matters. Not scrolling on social media for entertainment, but really focusing on your business. Peace.